aja terus terjadi gondomi Uh, this area is suffering from severe erosion, um, so literally hundreds of meters of coastline have been lost. Um, and um, one of the reasons is that the mangroves have disappeared. Um, and we know that mangroves uh, have a strong coastal protection function. Because of their roots, they, uh, they can attenuate waves, uh, at least for smaller waves. Um, and they can grab and uh, capture sediment. Um, so we were thinking of how can we bring this function back again here. Um, and you see that in this area um, a lot of activities have already been undertaken. undertaken. Like um, uh, there are wave breakers, people are planting mangroves, but the situation is so disturbed that this doesn't work anymore. So actually the wave breakers make it worse because they increase the wave force and wave height. Um, and if you plant mangroves, they, they're simply washed away because the sediment balance is just too disturbed. So what we need to do here is restore the sediment balance so that there is enough mud for the mangroves to uh, come back. Uh, and once the mangroves are back, they can uh, have their coastal protection function again. Okay, in this area, Wetlands International and Deltares and other partners um, are applying a building with nature solution and building with nature um, is about working with the forces of nature instead of fighting against it. So in this case uh, we use permeable dams, uh, that's, that's a kind of engineering uh, and it brings back um, the mud in this area and it dampens the waves. So once the mud is back the mangroves can colonize. So that's where green and grey solutions meet. Okay, so now we are uh, in Bogorame uh, and we see here a, a permeable structure and the structure is meant to, uh, to uh, capture the sediment, to trap the sediment. And we actually uh, mimic the function of natural mangrove uh, roots because mangrove roots, they dampen the waves and they still let sediment go in. What you see here is that uh, well, this structure was placed in September and already now we see a lot of mud accumulating. And this is very good because when the mud starts accumulating the mangroves can recolonize. We already see some small plants, that, which is a very good sign. And then the mangroves can come back in and once the mangroves are in, they can retain the sediment even more stronger through their rooting system. Uh, you clearly see uh, over there the difference in wave height. So the waves on this end of the structure are much higher uh, than inside the structure. And uh, we call that uh, building with nature. So we integrate natural elements with uh, traditional, more traditional uh, solutions. Uh, and in some cases those uh, solutions can be uh, uh, quite low tech actually. So like here we are uh, introducing these permeable structures or permeable dams um, and uh, this was actually inspired by a solution that we in the Netherlands uh, applied for over a century but then with salt marshes so we worked in, an, in the Netherlands in an area that was also suffering from erosion and land was lost and uh, the people reclaimed the land just by building these structures and then the salt marshes were able to recolonize and we could build outward.